Oh, that's right, baby. J Rock is here. What the hell was that? Oh, uh, Will, chill out, doc. Chill, okay? It ain't that damn serious. Or is it? Hi, J Rock has come back to you, too. What is happening in 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 with the millions? <laughs> and millions of J-Rock's fans from all over the world. Oh, that's right, baby. J-Rock is here. And last night at the Academy Awards, the Oscars, you all saw it. Y'all saw what happened. Will Smith walked up on stage and laid the smack down on Chris Rock's Rudy Pooh. Candy ass. Will, you got to chill out, though, bro. And if you didn't see it, John Boy Media's channel going to take us through what happened. And having a great time and Chris Rock's on stage and he's making jokes about all the people in the crowd and poking fun out of them and Will Smith's there. He's smiling and having himself a grand time. And then Chris Rock's going to make a joke about Will Smith's wife, Jada. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? And if you don't know what that joke is, G.I. Jane's a movie with Demi Moore where she had to shave her head, buzz cut, and Jada Smith has recently come open to the public about her struggles with hair loss and alopecia. Yeah, at this point, I can only laugh. Now, y'all know I've been struggling with alopecia. And... So, at this point, she can only laugh. She's been struggling with it. She came out. It's a big deal. And uh, so, let's, let's hear the joke again. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? And Will Smith accidentally finds it hilarious. Uh-huh. Then yeah, he looked over his wife like, oh. And chuckle galore. One more time. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? Will's laughing it up. Uh-oh. Jada did not like the joke. She stares some daggers Chris Rock's way. She ain't all that Sometime crazy about Chris Rock. right after this scene, she's going to turn to Will, give him the same look, and that's going to change the way this goes. <laughs> That was a nice one. Okay. That was a nice one. Okay, forget about it. Let's just move on and let's let this die. I'm out here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Richard. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> and that is, so at this point, everyone's like, "Is that real? Is that fake? What the hell was that?" Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. I like Will Smith's style here because I feel like this is a slap that he learned on a movie set somewhere because he really sticks it. So he goes palm out and then he really follows through like Karate Kid. Like, that just doesn't seem like a normal slap. It seems like a movie set taught him that full body twist and Chris Rock just eats it. I tried to zoom in because it still seems fake at this point, but it wasn't a punch. It was a slap. And Chris Rock just eats it, and he's like, what the hell? Take my name out your fucking mouth. People are still kind of laughing in the background, like, uh, what the hell's going on? I, wow, dude. I, wow, dude, I, is the I ultimate I response when someone I didn't, overreacts to a joke. That's pretty universal. That's probably been going on for 60 years. Wow, dude. Really? Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane joke. He, my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? I'm going to. I don't want to be Chill. with you in any way anymore. We're good. And the whole audience goes silent now because it's like... Oh. Everybody's like... <laughs> oh, I could go. Okay. I think he's saying there, oh, I could, and I'm like, what could you do? <laughs> oh, I could go. Okay. Oh, I could do it. Oh, Whatever oh. you could do. That was a... Uh... Greatest night in the history of television. Okay. Okay. Let so me get myself here. together. To uh, give a documentary out. To, ah, to give an Oscar. To give an Oscar out. Yeah. That's the only flaw in the whole thing from Chris Rock. Everything else he did was amazing. If he would have nailed the next line, it would have been great, but he's not here to give a documentary out. That would be weird, unless he's a producer somewhere. I just want to show you that after the punch... As far as we can see, Chris Rock never touches his face, never rubs it, never nothing. So, I mean, he comes out the big winner if this is real. I also love this look behind stage. Like, we're just going to, you guys aren't going to stop or anything. We're just going <laughs> to, right? Uh, 
yeah, you want me to just stay up here and do the presentation as I had planned? Give the documentary out? All right. Sounds good. Sherlock says this. Oh, for a second. I'm thinking it was scripted. I'm like, okay, they planned this and then everything. Uh, then and then, then afterwards, some, 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 somebody that was at the Oscars, they, they, they caught this on video. Seconds. Please clear the aisles down front. He crying. Well, it looks like he is. Fifteen. Please that, clear That's the front. Denzel clear kneeling down clear. talking to Jada. Afterwards, Will Smith wins an Oscar. Go figure. And it wasn't for the acting or the punch he just, or the slap rather, that he just gave Chris Rock. Actually, for his movie, uh, what, what's what's the what's the name of the movie he was in? Oh, it doesn't matter what the name is. The only thing that matters is Will Smith had this to say to show you that this wasn't scripted. This was real. Richard Williams um, was a fierce defender of his family. <laughs> in this time in my life, in this moment, I am overwhelmed by what God is calling on me to do and be in this world. Making this film, I got to protect Ingenue Ellis, who was one of the most, the strongest, most delicate people I've ever met. I got to protect Sanaya and Demi, the two actresses that played Venus and Serena. I'm being called on in my life to love people and to protect people and to be a river to my people. And I know to do what we do, you gotta be able to take abuse, you gotta be able to have people talk crazy about you. In this business, you gotta be able to have people disrespecting you. And you gotta smile and you gotta pretend like that's okay. But Richard Williams, and what I loved, thank you, D. Denzel said to me a few minutes ago, he said, at your highest moment, be careful, that's when the devil comes for you. Well, J-Rock says this. Uh, we saw Will Smith's reaction. Now let's check out what Chris Rock did. Chris Rock, after Everything went down. Nah, uh, that wasn't that hard, bro. Yeah, see, it wasn't that bad. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, just go man. home. Don't lie to him, bro. He slapped the shit out of him, bro. <laughs> you saw he slapped the shit out of you. He did, bro. Your you head hurt. You said he slapped the shit out of you. I'm a... you, you, you said that. Yeah. Man, hell no, then, man. Come on. Hey, let me see my shoes. Let me see my shoes. Bro, Chris, you're old, man. You're a great guy. No, it's not too late. I'm saying, man. It's over now. No, I was playing. I thought he was playing. I didn't know. He was trying to fight for real. Let me see who it is. Nah, Chris. Let me see who Okay, you should have did something while you was on stage. I didn't have no grip. I don't think I had grip. Come on, yeah, man. I didn't know. I know. Tell him, come on, man. Tell him, come on. Your family was at that place. RDC World 1 are quick on it, boy. They quick to it. You're not going to get no more serious roles in your movies, bro. Hey, stop playing. Go get Will right now. Go get Will. Go get Will. Man, no, that's on the Oscars. That's a lot. Will! 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 Will!
Where he at? Where he at? Which way is he? Where the hell? I'm telling you, I'm ready to fight anybody in this family. Anybody. Jaden! You can't fight Jaden, bro. Jaden! No, because that shit was weak. He caught me off guard. I was coming up there to shake my hand or something. I didn't think that joke was that serious. I was playing with. Where the hell? You know that's not something to joke about, man. Man, no, that shit weak, bro. All my, all my life, bro, they've been playing me like I'm a kid, bro. Everybody hates Chris. Every fucking thing I've done, I'm not a joke, bro. Where the hell? Well, J-Rock says this, RGC 101 are quick to it, man. They got on this quick, fast, and in a hurry. Shout out to those brothers. Um, what J-Rock thinks about Will Smith look? Will Smith, over the past few years, has been going through it. With his marriage, with his wife, her quote-unquote entanglement. Uh, she has publicly professed her love for Tupac, who, you know, unfortunately, you know, was, was, was tragically murdered. Uh, a long time ago. And so, Will and Jada, they've been the brunt of jokes, especially Will. His manhood has been tested. He's been called out, told he's weak, a whole bunch of other stuff. Like, how you going to stay with this woman if she didn't, you know, admittedly cheat it? She can call it what she want to, an entanglement, a uh, 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 rectanglement, or it doesn't matter what it is. The fact of the matter is, is that you got to do the nasty with another jabroni and then you have publicly admitted it but then because you called it an entanglement that's supposed to make it all right no bro you cheated just call it what it is you had an affair while we were married and will has been going through it all right children going crazy and will is in hollywood trying to hold it together and he just snapped at the wrong time Y'all know good and hell well. First of all, I'm wondering why the hell didn't Chris Rock immediately swing back? First of all, you're not finna walk up on national TV, punch me, and think I'm just finna sit there and take it. Oh, no, 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 no. I wonder if Will would have done this if this was Dwayne The Rock Johnson who had made that joke. You think he gonna walk up on The Rock and do that? Hell no. But he did it because it was Chris Rock. All right? Now, I didn't. I don't think Chris thought it, anything was like that was going to happen because it never does. But I think Will just snapped. All the pressure and everything, a man can only take so much. All right? That's why you got to stop pretending like stuff don't bother you. You got to stop pretending like stuff ain't getting to you. You got to acknowledge it. You got to own it. And you got to let it out because if you don't, It'll come out at the wrong time. And in Will Smith's case, it came out at the worst time in a moment that was supposed to be one of the best moments of his life. He tainted it. I get it. The devil going, the devil didn't do that to you, Will. You did that. He did that because he wanted to do it. The devil didn't make him do that. Stop blaming the devil. You did that because you wanted to do it. You're so sick and tired of folks blaming the devil. The devil has no power to make anybody do anything. Now, you can say that was of the devil. That was a, a devilish deed. But you still had control over what you were doing. But with that being said, uh, this is going to be talked about for a while. I don't know if Will and Jada are going to be invited back because you remember a few years ago, they boycotted the Oscars. Because they didn't have any black nominees. And then Chris Rock went on to talk about, you know, uh, Jada Pinkett boycotting the Oscars is like me boycotting Rihanna's panties. I wasn't invited. Y'all know Chris jokes. He makes a lot of jokes. But in fairness to Chris, he jokes on everybody. And I guess Will just had had enough of the jokes, the game, the laughter, the kick he can, and said, bro, that's enough. And he got mad and he slapped the dude. Uh, I thought it was scripted. Obviously, it wasn't. It was awkward as hell. Folks in the audience didn't know what to think. Neither did Chris. And, yeah, that was unnecessary, Will. You need to call that man and apologize to him, all right? 
I get it. You're on a lot of pressure. You're on a lot of stress. You can't do that, though. You cannot do that. All right? Now, you guys tell me what you thought of it. All right? Post your comments down below. Let J-Rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video. No rhyme. Intended on that line. If you enjoyed the great one's reaction, the like button, subscribe, and share. Be sure that you hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Stay tuned for my next video. Mamba, GG, and Wakanda. It is me! Wow! What a rock he is! Cookie.